because it is finally cooling down in Tokyo. I can be outside without feeling so hot all the time. Usually during the week, my house is a complete pigsty. So this week my focus has been really on tidying up, cleaning up, putting washing on, doing the dishes before the weekend. So then my weekend is a weekend. It's, it's a restful time. I can go and do things. So in Japan, uh, we didn't have room in our apartment for our washing machine and it's not uncommon to keep your washing machine outside. So I had to come out here onto the balcony to put on the washing. And now I'm just going to enjoy the night air. I might have um, some strawberry milk and relax. I'm thinking to have a hot bath. I don't think I've had a hot bath in Maybe <laughs> three months since before summer because it's just so gross I don't know how people do it like going to the center going to the onsen in summer um, it's not for me and um, we wouldn't usually fill the bath right up to the top but I just have not had a bath in so long I really wanted that like up to the shoulder experience so I'm gonna get my salts and add them now I forgot I have this hinoki sachet, so I'm probably going to add that instead of the salt. <sighs> it is like instantly relaxing. I feel like I'm in nature as soon as I smell it. Oh my god, this is so good. I feel like I'm like whispering in all my videos and honestly I'm not that great at speaking loudly on the best of days so <laughs> I'm gonna do the face mask. This is the Luma, Lu I, don't, I honestly don't know how to pronounce it, I'm assuming. Um, <laughs> it's the Yuzu Moisturizing Face Mask. Um, I haven't actually done this one before so I'm excited. I know these ones always have so much of the like juice, the moisturizing juice. Let's give it a go. Oh yeah, so juicy. Mm. More like Lulu Yum. Am I right? <laughs> How is the face track still following my face? That's actually amazing. I feel like my nose is always bigger than <laughs> the space that they create. So while I've got this on, I'm going to do something about this mess that is going on here in my bathroom. There is nothing better than a cold face mask, so I'm going to go and put these in the fridge for next time. I feel like the funniest omiyagi I bought back for myself from Australia <laughs> is these COVID antigen tests because, um, I just feel like they're so expensive in Japan and I have to like sign a declaration sometimes it's just such a hassle one of my favorite things that I found secondhand in Japan is this first aid kit um it is really unusable actually inside it's um obviously like missing a tray or something like I'm sure it was better designed originally um but yeah everything is a bit of a mess it is not how I would want it to be, but I'm trying to get it there, trying to keep everything the way I like it. Of course, got the uh, Cole Smart by Chest Rub ointment. That expired when? September 2015. So still going strong, obviously. Next, I'm going to be putting on this cream. It's alright. <laughs> Again, I don't know. It looked like it was like highly recommended um, in Don Quixote so I went you know what sure I'll have what everyone else is having honestly I look like I've just been born as in covered in placenta not young and beautiful
I just had a nap. It is now the afternoon. I have not left the house since I got home from work uh, last night, after work Friday night. Um, but yeah, I got up early, did a bunch of cleaning and house chores and stuff, and then I just got really tired from that. Maybe, uh, maybe it's laziness, maybe it's long COVID. But yeah, so I don't know what I'm going to get up to today. I think there is a summer festival happening maybe in my town. Uh, I'm not really sure. I'm going to take my bicycle and go check out what I can see. Um, I was meant to be meeting Oni, but I think she's still asleep. She has like severe jet lag after getting back from the UK. And Yusuke is skateboarding in Chiba all day. So just me, but that's fine. I'm really enjoying my solo time recently, so... Yeah, let's see what I can get up to. Good morning. <laughs> Oni's finally awake. Let's check the time. Only 3.10 p.m. <laughs> oh, it's bad. <laughs> I managed to convince Oni to come over now and we'll probably do stuff now that the sun's starting to go down. So yay! Before she comes I'm gonna do my dishes. I hate washing dishes so much I put it off. Um, I hate touching them, I have to wear like gloves. I don't know what is wrong with me. Hello. We're going towards the drum sound. Surely there will be a festival. Hey, 
はい。はい。はい。はい。<笑>
it's at the Green Springs complex and I got these um, set of plastic bags which I thought would be just really really cute gift bags um, for whenever I buy people presents um, and I just think they're so cute like you can reuse it all the time I got these little stickers look at this little almond boy so cute and then I got this gift wrap paper as well or maybe the bags actually it looks like paper bag at any rate just loved it so cute 100% orange is the brand I believe and only 140 yen absolute bargain I love it and it was really funny to me but I found the T2 Melbourne breakfast in Don Quixote and I just had to buy it because you know I don't know when I'm gonna get back to Melbourne so now I can enjoy I actually brought some back from Melbourne for my co-workers um, but they weren't individually wrapped and so I felt like no one wanted to take them because yeah in Japan I think individually wrapped omiyage is definitely the best kind of omiyage to bring um, but then they don't they're not individually wrapped they kind of come in like a plastic bag uh, and that is just not Japanese omiyage friendly so anyway I'm gonna enjoy these so it's a pretty gloomy rainy day today um, Sunday had the best time last night with Oni I just love hanging out with her I feel like so myself and so relaxed and so at peace after seeing her so if you're ever in the Tokyo area and you have a chance to befriend her I recommend she's so great um, yeah so today I don't really know what I'm gonna do I'm meant to be meeting up with a friend um, and maybe going to a cafe or something but we're not really sure if it's like good enough weather to go out so I'm thinking if I don't do that then maybe I'll ride my bike in the rain to the second hand store and check that out and just waste some hours in the second hand store I also want to finish some rubber stamps so yeah maybe I'll do that maybe this evening mm. and because I've been trying to set myself some good habits I've already done all my washing and laundry for the week so I don't really have many like tasks to do at home except some shopping for groceries and things like that also I'm having to wear my hair like this today because it's again so rainy and so humid that uh, I can't really do much else with it doesn't really look good any other way so slicking it back today so I'm just about to leave to go and see my friend it's raining so I've got on my big raincoat which to be honest the colors don't really match much but it does the trick I'll take it off once I'm inside anyway so yeah got my little peanut butter pouch for my camera stuff and off we go hopefully it doesn't rain too much today so much I just think they're so cute and so funny and I found this soft moruka in the second hand store it's like not a second hand store it's only for like anime goods and games and toys and this was in there and only 800 yen I couldn't say no my neighbor brought me some corn from Hokkaido. Yummy. I am headed to 
see the second hand still. I had about a 15 minute nap and I woke up naturally before my alarm. I'm feeling good. My body feels a bit tired though. So this is the second hand store near my house. It's called Hard Off and Off House, which is great. It has two levels and it's so big. But yeah, they had an amazing selection in there. I was going to film more, but um, they were starting to close and I was really focused on trying to get some bargains. So maybe in another video, I'll do a bit more of an in-depth look at the second-hand stores in Japan if you want. and I had a falling out as couples do it's totally normal to, I'm just so tired from it he's really tired from it just gonna rest tonight and try and recover sometimes relationships are really difficult especially if there are cultural differences yeah today was one of those days um, I think I'm gonna put in the new kitchen sheet in the kitchen on the shelf and try and do some cleaning and sorting of things to make myself feel a bit better. I think recently I always want to be productive with my time off because I get so little time off and work really hard during the week so yeah it's difficult when a day doesn't go as planned trying to stay grounded and try and focus on the present and just gotta do what I can do with the rest of the day. So I cleaned out the kitchen and I put new paper in and things are going well with me and Micha. things are pretty back to normal now I'm watching Baymax and I'm gonna go to sleep tomorrow is a new day So today I'm on my way to Koenji. I'm going to do a glass bead making course with my friend Mariko. I don't know if they'll let us film much um, or if there'll be time to film anything. So I might just show you the finished piece because I believe we can take it home at the end of the workshop. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. I love seeing Mariko and I love trying new workshops with her. We've done ceramic making before together and that was really fun. It's also really nice to be out of the house so early. 
our workshops at 10 so I had to get up early to get ready but it's good and I have the rest of the day to unwind and do some other things <laughs> I feel like I made my balls way bigger than that. I think so too. <laughs> That's true. So happy. <laughs> you look tired. <laughs> we are at the outdoor cinema near our house. It's in a complex called Green Springs. Tonight they're showing Iron Man for free. The only downside for me is that it's dubbed in Japanese, which I'm not fluent in, so it's gonna be interesting, but it's an action movie, so I feel like you don't really need to understand everything. 